name is Victor and today I'm going to show you how to find a composite function given two different functions. So let's say I have a function called f of x and this function is going to be x plus 3. And we're given another function called g of x and this function is going to be 2x plus 4. Okay. Now composite functions are usually denoted by either f o g or f of g of x and both of these imply the same meaning basically they mean we have two different functions we have an f function and we have a g function so a composite function what it is is basically the last function that's written which in this case it's g is going to go inside of the first function, right? Or as we see down here, the g of x, which is the g function, is going to be inside the f function. So it sounds kind of complicated, but it's really not that complicated. Because what we're going to do is we're going to look for all the x's that are in the f, which in this case we have one x here, right? Now this x is going to be replaced by all of g. So the whole g function is going to go inside of the x that's inside of the f function. So let's go ahead and write that out. We have, instead of the x now, we're going to have a 2x plus 4. And what was left of the f function? We still had that plus 3. So we have to add 3. Right? Now we go ahead and combine like terms. So in front of this set of parentheses, we could just drop this set of parentheses because there's nothing in the front. So we have 2x plus 4 plus 3. Now the like terms here are the 4 and the 3. So 4 plus 3 gives us a 7, a positive 7. And we're just going to drop our 2x. So there we have it. The composite function fog is going to be 2x plus 7. Thank you for watching. Until next time.